In this tutorial we'll show you how to create and set up special pages for your membership, namely login, logout and password reminder pages. Make sure you have already watched the related tutorial that shows you how to create a simple page first, that does not require login, then proceed with this tutorial. The first step is to open the Levo and click the plugins icon in the menu. Click Pages. In our first tutorial we created a page with the title slash path my underscore test underscore page. Click on the link of the page to open it. The easiest way to add a new page is to click on the duplicate button. Verify that the duplication has been successful and you're viewing the new record. As you can see, once you add a new page, a new section is revealed that allows you to title the group of the pages, because now you have more than one page inside the group. You can type a descriptive title in the group title field for your own use so to remember what that group of pages is about. For example, you can type my first membership using pages. Or even better, since this membership will require from the users to log in first in order to view your membership's content we'll rename it to my first free membership using pages. In the group template section, we'll use the default template with the title example skin. In another tutorial we show you how to create a new template. Check the radio button pages require user login to change this page's group protection. For now we'll not deal with the section menu, we'll explain this functionality in another tutorial. The section pages in this group includes the URLs of all the pages you add in this group. Next you need to set up the specific pages properties. In the URL field you will need to type in the title of this page. The URL field corresponds to the path field we saw in the tutorial when created the first simple page. Remember A, to start with, and also and with, B, not to use spaces and C, not to use in the URL field the title of an existing directory in your hosting account. In this example, we use the title slash login underscore page slash. Next add the title to be used for this page in the page title field. That title will be used in the title meta tag of the page. We do not change the template in the page template section. That way the template we defined in the group properties will be used for this page too. We do not change the page protection for this page. In the page type section select the special type of page. From the new options displayed, check the login page radio button. In the content section, you can edit the text of your page with the information you want to display in the login page. We'll change the title to my first free membership. For we want to create a login page, we need to add a form, hence copy the tag hash form. In this example we'll add only the login form in this page, so we delete the rest of the content. For your convenience, you may add a descriptive text where you want to include the hash form, tag and the code of the page. In this example, we use the text add the login form. Click on the HTML icon to view the source code of the page. Select the descriptive text you used. Replace it with the hash form, tag. Click Save Changes and stay on this page. The new page has been added in the pages in this group section with the title we typed that also indicates the URL of the page, e. login underscore page slash. You can preview the page by clicking the link open next to the title of the page. That's it. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial. You can always use the forum in case you need a clarification about this tutorial. Your feedback makes us better. Thank you.